He had problems all over, including uh, the San Fernando Valley. The relentless rain created chaos on the roads. Christy Farardo is live in Encino with the stories of drivers who had to be rescued there as well. Christy. Yeah, Jeff and Pat, conditions have really improved. In fact, drivers are not having any problem going down the street. You just saw one car drive through there. That's because the waters have receded. But if you walk with me, I can show you all the mud that was left behind gives you some idea of just how big the puddle got. And that right over there is the culprit. That drain clogged up and the waters started rising. I tried to drive through the big puddle because I saw other cars doing it. Janelle Lum never made it to school, but learned a lesson anyway. My car just stopped. That's a good Samaritan carrying her from her flooded car at Oxnard and Lasane in Encino. Before he got to her, she'd been trapped for over an hour. I moved over to the passenger side because it wasn't flooding in there yet. And then it started flooding on the passenger side. And then I was just stuck with my feet like on the seat. Cell phone video shows just how many others made the same mistake. Crews used a raft to pull out drivers. Around the valley, so much flooding, so many rescues. Lum says she waited hours for a tow truck. They called me and said that they couldn't make it because the streets were blocked off and it was too flooded. In North Hollywood, a familiar scene. Ali Sagumian herself wrote, What a nightmare. She rolled on what she was seeing. Rising water, other trapped cars, wipers still going, and a lake in the middle of Vineland near Van Owen. The water was getting more and more, and my car just stopped. The entire water went inside my car. I literally felt like it was the ocean. <laughs> the drivers of these other cars may have felt the same. A dip in the road pooled the water and hid the danger. After two hours, all the cars, including Sagumians, were back on dryish land, even as they were towed out. It was still raining. I'm still very wet. This was just, I can't even believe this is happening in California. All the drivers we saw got out okay, but tell us they've learned a very valuable lesson. Next time they see a large puddle, they'll drive around it. Live in Encino, Christy Fajardo, CBS 2 News.